Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm David, I'm your chef David. Tonight's video, let's make sauté string bean. So making a sauté string bean, the ingredients, they are very easy to find. So I got here um, string bean. Some people call them the green bean. Um, pound and a half, two green onion, I got some garlic over here, and then this is ground pork. If you can't have pork, replace this with chicken, beef, or shrimp, or fish. Okay, so let's get it started. Okay, the first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna take care of the string bean. Okay, the bean, you see the stem, you gotta remove the stem and the tips. And then you're gonna break them half. And it looks like this. Actually, this dish, salted shrimp bean, very popular in the Chinese restaurant. A lot of places they put pork in it. But if you can't have pork, you just tell them, you know, tell the waiter or waitress, they can substitute for beef or chicken for you. I like it spicy. So you can make this into a Saint Chai style saute string bean. Sometime you go to the Cantonese restaurant, they have this and they call them saute string bean with the XO sauce. I don't know if you guys seen that before, but they're pretty tasty too. Okay, here we go guys. 450 grams of a string bean. And this is the hardest part for making this dish. All right, so let's get the sauce now. I got some garlic, four pieces of garlic. We're just gonna smash this and chop it up a little bit. And the green onion. I'm only using the end part. Now let's make the sauce for the saute string bean. So I have half shot of cooking wine and a half shot of plain water. Soy sauce, this is the tablespoon. Dark soy sauce, half a tablespoon. Now I got the high shen sauce. You're gonna need this. It'll taste very good if you add this into it. Half a tablespoon. Okay, now I got the teaspoon. Sugar, one teaspoon. Chicken base. A lot of people ask me, what's a chicken base? So here we go. This is the chicken base. It's a chicken flavor soup base mix. It's a good replacement for MSG. So I got one teaspoon in it. White pepper powder, quarter teaspoon. Sesame oil, quarter teaspoon. Now we're gonna mix it. If you like hot sauce, make it spicy. You can um, add the chili oil into it right now. Here we go, guys. All right, guys, I'm waiting for the wok to get hot. I'm going to fry the green bean first. So now we're going to test the oil. It's not hot enough. Oil looks good. This side here, I have water. When you fry the shrimp bean, it tastes so much different than you just boiled it. But it gets a little greasy. That's why I got this pot of water here. I'll, I'll show you guys how to take care of it. This is the same way that I was making in, in my restaurant. It's just the equipment are different. Now I'm over here on this side. Oh, see the water? 
it's almost boiled. So put this in. Kind of just wash it. Wash the oil off. And yeah, take them out. Let's wait for the wok to heat up and we're gonna make the sauteed string bean. Let's go back to the sauce. If you like your string bean flavor a little stronger, add another half of a teaspoon of the sugar and another half tablespoon of a high shen sauce. That will make this string bean taste much, much better. The oil. The first thing we're gonna do, the ground pork. Cook it. And almost ready, then you put the garlic. Man, I wish you guys were here. You can just smell this. Flavors coming out from the garlic, the onion, and the pork belly here. If today I was making this, the spicy Sichuan style, I would add some red jalapeno and a green one, and some red dried pepper, and Sichuan pepper. Okay, now put the shrimping in. Now we cook. Guys, the sauce it makes it well. Put them in. Let it cook for like three, four minutes. Let the beans and the in the meat absorb the sauce. I have half. You don't need water. Salty scrapings or dry dish. You guys see this? This is white vinegar. You are going to need a half. Half a teaspoon. Here we go, it's done. Take a look. Check it out guys. Hey you guys. Thanks for watching my video. Check this out. Saute shrimp bean. Thank you guys. If you like it, hit the like button. Subscribe my channel. And I'll see you guys very soon.